Greetings, what's up and welcome back to RZ is a customizer. Here we build, we share and we inspire you guys. Today we're gonna take a look at not one but two plastic model kit by Bandai. These are the padded Ritz Fat Grand Order series. There's a game and also an anime from this model kit line. The girl on the left is Mash Kirillite, or we call her Mashu Chan, and she's actually a servant, a shielder, uh, carrying this huge shield to protect herself from the enemies, also fight with the shield. The girl on the right, her name is Jin the Arc. This is actually the alter version or the evil version, and in the game they call it the corrupted. Holy Maiden. There are eight different characters so far in Petit Bridge line. First one was the Shielder, the Mash, and the second one is the Caster, the Nero, and the third is the Avenger, the Jin, the Alter version. And we do have the Master, and we do have the Saber. This is the Miyamoto Musashi version, and also we do have another Saber, the Okita Soji version, and. We do have the Archer, the Gilgamesh, and the latest one that came out pretty recently, uh, the Saber Altria Pendragon. Before the Petit Ritz line was announced by Bandai in last year, actually there was another kit, also almost the same like Petit Ritz, but they call it the Petitio Rise. And the characters are actually from the anime The Girl on Panzer and also the Love Life Sunshine. And the difference between the Petitio Rise with this Petit Ritz, well, as you guys can see, the first, the Petitio Rise, you can get um, three characters uh, or two characters in one box, but with minor um, parts like the body, you need to get an extra body for from the other box, and also you need. Um, to swap some parts like the hands, like the legs, just like an android. For the size comparison with Nandroid Hinata, High Grade Gumpla RX78, Figurize Standard Ayame, Frame Up Skill Sylphie, Mega Me Device Bullet Knights. First, let's check out the Mash Kirillite, the Shielder, and she comes with decals here. And actually, you need to use the uh, I decal here for this one since the face plate originally blank so you need to apply this one for yourself and also this piece here actually this is for the outfit and same goes with this one and I didn't use it because I plan to paint this one in the future so other than that she comes with this uh, blue action base or I call it just a base uh, with this uh, support thing for her uh, legs here so she can she can stand like this and aside of that yes it, she do have this shield here so let's check out the this is a front view and we have the side view here and the back view and with the shield before we move on with the kit let's check out the shield despite the size of this kit is pretty small just like almost the same like the Nandroid one I really amazed with the details on this kit look at this even the part separation this is actually the one piece and well this one is this thing is one piece and this thing is also one piece at the back of the shield here we do have this handle with the grabby hand here um, actually she comes with only two different hands this is a grabby hand and the left hand is actually um, the open hand so that's it you don't get any extra hands for this one and just simply see there's a whole pack here this pack goes inside even this piece here this part is also a separate part same goes with this piece and this piece too and well nothing much we can do about this this is the whole part so this is the shield for the articulation, let's start with this hat here. Her head is using a simple ball joint so she can make one full rotation like that. Head go up about that far, go down, 
about that far side to side like so and for the arm uh, there's a tiny ball joint here so we can make movement like that and go up and down and then forward backward and then there's a swivel here and then bend like so and then back oh this this is kind of weird actually there's a it's a very simple connection here just two pieces that fit all together like that and there's a rotation here and then that's it and she comes with um, for the left hand we have the open hand here you can see open hand and also for the right hand is the grabby hand and for the man body part there's no articulation this is fixed unfortunately this is fixed and for the lower part actually she can move a little bit um, can move forward like that and then backward like so and spread spread like so because of the skirt is blocking the way so there's a very little movement at the bottom here and unfortunately there's no articulation for the leg this is kind of disappointed because we do have the articulation here point one point two even the head but there's no articulation for the leg this is actually one piece and it is pretty disappointed when i don't know why they don't want to make the articulated joint as is make a simple joint here so the leg can move or bend but we do have a movement here this this heel here there's a movement but not much and that's it and to attach this kit to her action base here uh, we do have this piece here to snap um, onto her leg just grab this piece and then snap that one in and there we go she can stand like so next is Jin well this is the front view the side view and then the back view so let's start with her weapon here first thing I need to assemble all the weapon um, let's start with this sword here there we go let's remove this piece and the swords are pretty detailed despite the size is pretty small but it's pretty detailed you guys can see this thing here see it's pretty nice detail like so and you need to handle this with care because this piece is so so fragile because this is a pretty small and just one solid piece um, with this lens here this is also a flag you can see so you can see the detail of this flag here see even this piece too and if we turn it back well this is actually like the whole part and this sharp thing this blade also detail and for this flag is actually you need to use the water slide decal that provided with this kit um, you need to apply the white one here this is actually the white decal here onto this flag and then you need to use this uh, symbol here the black one on the top of the white one so you can get a very nice and detailed uh, flag but I didn't use this one because I plan to um, paint it uh, this kit soon so I don't want to use this one first and that is for the flag and this kit comes with two um, grabby hand so that's it just grabby hand for both uh, right and left for the articulation let's start with the head just like the mushroom one and this is the same ball joint and then you can make one full rotation like 
that and then your head can move up and down like so side to side like so and for the arm here using the same uh, tiny ball joint and can move up about that far down forward then backward and then a swivel here the movement here and you can make band about that much and actually this PC also can move that much and then the hand can make one full rotation so that's it and for the man body part there's no movement here except this thing here this is for the weapon and it can actually move freely like so and then there's no articulation for this uh, her bottom outfit here just one solid piece but there's an articulation for the back here just not much the back can move forward backward like so same goes with this side too forward and backward and yeah there's no articulation for the legs um, the legs cannot bend uh, same goes with this um, high heel here can make movement like that and like so can make a little pivot and then this is actually using This is actually using a tiny ball joint so it can move around and make a pivot and then forward, backward. So, this is kind of a very simple articulation for a simple uh, design, but unfortunately, they didn't give you the band for the legs. It's kind of disappointed actually. And for the detail of this thing, the jean detail, well, like, kind of impressive. It, well, despite the scale of this thing is pretty small, but the details are pretty insane. Especially for her head here, as you can see. Okay, we do have this head detail here. And also this piece. And you need to be careful with this one because this is easy to break. And some goes with this. Um, upper detail here even the hair at the back looks pretty cool indeed and then you can see the let me take this one and you can see this detail on her armor here you can see the detail of the chain looks pretty sick it's pretty small and even this upper armor here and then there's a symbol right here too and then at the back here well nothing much and even this thing here is pretty pretty cool here this part of the armor see even the detail of this one is pretty nice um, on her high heel you can see this tiny detail here so a lot of thing going on and I really amazed with the small details that Bandai make for this uh, jean armor here. And I forgot to mention uh, like the Mashu one, you need to use uh, the eye decal here for this one because originally the face plate is blank so you need to um, apply your own water slide decal for this one to attach this kit onto her action base here um, there's a this part here just simply snap this onto her one of her leg it's like that so that's it just plug in like that and she can stand on her right flaming action base in conclusion this padded ritz plastic ball kit line are pretty amazing i really 
amazed with what they did. The small details uh, for the characters are pretty amazing. And this is the first time ever I assemble um, characters from my very um, favorite anime in the game, the Fed series and Fed Grand Order. I kind of really amazed with this one and the feel is pretty different compared to getting uh, a figure and then for the disappointment yes yes uh, we do share the same uh, opinion on this one uh, there's an articulation for the legs here yeah. that's all the video for today I hope you guys enjoy watching it and don't forget to subscribe my channel hit that like button leave a comment down below and also share my contents you guys can also check out my Facebook page as well, RZ Easy Customizer. The links are in description down below. I do customizing, I do kit bashing, a lot of stuff with plastic model kit. Thank you very much for watching this video here on RZ Easy Customizer. We will, we share, and we're inspired. So that's all for me today. Check out, bye.